this video, I'm gonna show you how to take some basic Dollar Tree plastic planters, these two piece items with the drainage tray, and upgrade them into some beautiful pieces for your home. For this first planter, we are going to uh, use some rope and some chalk paint. We're gonna take it apart and add some spray paint to just the bottom part of the main planter and then cover the full drainage tray with spray paint as well. Then we're gonna take this nice thick rope. You can find this at Dollar Tree as well. I'm gonna grab that hot glue gun and just wrap the rope all around the main part of the planter. That's it for that one. We just place it into the drainage tray. It has some nice neutral colors. Pop a plant in there, and this is gonna look great inside or out. For our next planter, we are actually gonna take this blue bottom. We're not gonna use this. We're gonna put this off to the side. I'm gonna grab some fabric, measure it out, and cut it to size to fit around this planter. Now I actually have this fabric on a piano bench in my dining room, so I'm excited to use this one as an indoor planter to match. If you are watching this video and you like what you see, be sure to hit that like button and consider subscribing so you don't miss my next Simple Inspiring project. Now for this planter, we are just gonna cover the whole thing in Mod Podge, a nice light coat. And then we're gonna add a light coat to the backside of the fabric as well. Then we're gonna put them together and just use your fingers to smooth everything out, trim off any edges if they don't quite line up. And then you also wanna fold the fabric over the bottom and the top, securing everything really well. Once you have everything stuck on there, let, set it aside and just let it dry. Then we're gonna come back and add another coat of Mod Podge over everything to add a really nice seal. I would still recommend using this as an indoor planter. Now we're gonna grab the gray base from the other plastic pot and pair it with this beautiful yellow, black, and gray fabric and use it as an indoor planter. For our final planter, you can discard this base. We actually used that on the last planter. And we are going to grab a thick black paint pen. And on this pot, I'm just gonna draw an abstract pattern. I picked lines and dashes. You can pick any pattern you want and just repeat it across the whole pot. To add a little interest, I'm gonna paint the blue base a metallic gold color and pair that with this kind of boho abstract planter. Together, they look amazing. And again, this one can be used indoor or outdoor. There you have it, three ways to upgrade basic Dollar Tree planters. I hope this inspired you to go create something beautiful for your home. If you like these planters, give me a thumbs up and I hope you'll consider subscribing so you don't miss my next video. Thanks for watching.